I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. <laughs>
So, Miss Nicole, what did you do before you came here to West? I was the food assistant at Best Academy in Coretta Scott King for 10 years, and now I'm a manager at Westside. Did you enjoy your job there? Yes, I did. So, thank you for that. Bye, Westside. You're welcome. I'm Talia, and I'm here with Miss Licia. And I'm going to ask her um, a couple of questions. Mm -hmm. So, Miss Licia, what did you do before you came here to Westside? Okay, so before I came to Westside, uh, I was a Spanish teacher at like a private institution. I was like a homeschool Spanish teacher. So I went to this job every day. I worked for this private company and I had like three or four kids and I taught them Spanish. They were like seven though. So they were like babies. And then before that, I was a paralegal and I worked in law. So a paralegal is a person who works with an attorney in gets the paperwork ready for trial. So you all, like, you know when you see lawyers on TV and whenever they're in the courtroom, they pull their files and they're like, well, right here it says so-and-so did so-and-so. I prepared that file. They don't oh, do any of that. That's cool. I, I do that. They just review the case, but I prepare all the paperwork and I call courts and stuff like that. Um, I was about to be a legal interpreter, so sometimes in the courtrooms they'll have an interpreter in the courtroom. Mm -hmm. So I might, I was going to do that. Um, let's see. I also worked in a speech therapy office, which was like kids who are not speaking on the level they should be. There was a lot of Spanish speaking clients, so they hired me. So I would translate the therapy that the kids were getting. Mm -hmm. um, I've been an office manager. Um, my first job, I was a jewelry consultant, so I sold jewelry. Ooh. Yeah. So I've done a lot of little stuff. So, that sounds very, very cool. Is that, so, what was your favorite job and why did you decide to leave? Okay, so my favorite job was, I liked the speech therapy office because mm -hmm. I got to work with kids with disabilities and translate therapy sessions and I really liked that. But, it was cool, but I decided to work at Westside because I love Spanish, I love teaching Spanish, um, I think my kids say I'm a pretty okay teacher, so, yeah. you know. You're a um, great teacher, Miss Lisa. Thank you, thank you. Um, so I decided to look at Westside because I love Westside. I love the culture, the people. Um, and I just wanted to be a teacher and just teach Spanish. Because I like doing law and stuff, but not as much as I like teaching Spanish. And just languages in general. So, yeah, because Spanish is not the first language that I taught myself. Ooh, what were other languages? Um, the first one, when I was a kid, I used to mess around with different type of languages, so like Morse code and like everything. So first I practiced with Morse code because I thought I would be like a super spy, but that didn't happen. Um, but the first language I taught myself was sign language, mm. and then I started taking classes, and I started signing for my church. I don't know if you all have ever been to a church and seen a sign language interpreter at the front. So, um, I did sign language before I did Spanish. So I communicate with the deaf community. But now I'm a little rusty, but I mean, yeah. So sign language was the first one I learned, and then did Spanish. High five. Yeah. Is that it? Great job. Bye, Westside. Westsiders, we're here today with Miss Foz, and we're going to ask her what, is, what was her job before Westside? Well, my journey before Westside included teaching fifth grade everything, math, science, reading, writing, social studies um, in Fayette County. So that is a school district that's south of the airport. So I taught fifth grade for eight years in a title, two different title schools, and I loved it. Before that, I was a para-pro for first graders. So I was in a classroom with another teacher, helping first graders learn, and when I was in the classroom, I learned that I really love being with kids. I love getting them excited about learning, so went back to school at a late age and got my degree and my um, new career in teaching. And then we moved here to Atlanta, my husband and my family, and I found Westside right near my house. So exciting. Mm -hmm. So my favorite job has been teaching and reaching students and getting them excited about learning and having them understand that they're in control of their learning and that they can do anything they put their minds to. Mm -hmm. Do you want to shout out a teacher or one of your friends? Um, the whole staff, but I have to say my team, my fifth grade team, Ms. Frierson, Mr. Petaway, my sixth grade team, Esther, I love you, Dr. Mr. Searcy, love you, 
Peace. Bye, Westsiders. So, hi, Westsiders. We are here with Mr. Westry, and so we're going to ask him what he did before Westside. So what I did before Westside, I was in a... Uh, I did a lot of things. I, I was an executive director for a nonprofit called Evolving Arts of America, uh, which provided art programs for students in low income communities. Mm -hmm. That's what I did. Okay. What was, so you had many of them, right? Yes. So, what was your favorite like job out of all of them? Um, being the executive director of the mm -hmm. nonprofit was my favorite job out of all okay. of them. Thank you. Okay, bye, Westsiders.